one of the main reasons why I am involved with EIW is because of its focus on small business. Its desire to keep you from having to navigate the shark infested waters on your own, so to speak. I've gotten bitten a few times and they've drawn blood. So, you know, hopefully this will help out. I make it a point to have a good team of people around me that can keep me current on what's happening and how to, you know, stay ahead of whatever's going on. And seeing as how we are in Washington State, I'm not saying that they're not small business friendly. I'm just saying that they, there's a lot more challenges to doing business in Washington State because of some of the taxings and regulations that propose creative thinking for us to be able to continue to do our business well, continue to make a profit, and should we have employees to continue to pay them on time. So I was looking at our calendar, I was going, first off, how many people have actually viewed it? There's a lot of stuff on there, a lot of interesting things. We have a lot of um, project information, even though it is about small business right now. So there are opportunities for, for, for bidding and getting some understanding of what's going out there in the construction world. There's also um, some teaching opportunities for getting more understanding on how to, to figure out what it is that the customer is looking for. And then I stopped and thought about it, it's like, you are my customer. What is it that you need to make yourselves successful? I'm, not, I'm sure all of you have had a measure of success. But we all want to get, not necessarily further along, but we want to make an impact. We want something significant going on in our life. So I'm just kind of thinking, you know, what do you as a, our customer want to see placed in a way to help you navigate to where you want to be? I hope everybody's kind of understanding where I'm going. Because I really looked at it, it's like, okay, there's a lot of stuff on there, but is this going to help you get to your ultimate goal? Is it going to propel you in the direction you want to go? Or is it just a lot of, a lot of information? So what I'm trying to do is kind of encourage you to make sure that you give us input on what you want to see, input on what you're interested in. Because I know tonight that we're supposed to be talking about bonding, and a lot of people are probably thinking, well, I'm already bonded, or I've already got that covered. Well, when I started off, I was bonded. But then there came a time when I had increased my capacity, and there were some challenges financially and historically where I had to reach out and get some wisdom from somebody else. How do I get to where I need to go? Who's going to work with me? Not going, because it was like, I'm just, I'm transparent. It was personal history, not professional history. And a lot of businesses look, and a lot of financial institutions don't only look at what you're doing professionally, but they look at what you've done personally. So I reached out to a friend of mine, and they were able to give me the opportunity to learn how to increase my bonding, even though personally there were some financial situations going on. Catherine may be able to say something within her presentation that may make you go, ha ha, I hadn't thought of that. That's information that I can put in my tool belt and use further on down the road. So looking at the calendar, I'm like, this is supposed to be plotting us to get to where we want to go. So I want to make sure that we are putting on there what is of interest to you, that's going to help you succeed at what you're trying to do, that's going to help you grow your capacity, help you be the best small business owner that you can be. We are generating the economy of the state. And then when you look at it from state to state, we're generating the economy of the nation. And to me, that's a pretty big deal. 
especially with with all of the the political upheaval that's going on right now. You know, I'm sure, I hope everybody voted. But, you know, that's one way to voice what you want to do, how you want things to be. But even a better way is to make sure that you let us know in our capacity of what we're trying to do for you, this is what I'm looking for, so that you can let your voice be heard, so that we can pour into your lives what you need to be able to do the things that you really want to achieve. 